Hello, thanks for joining me on a flip of my new junk journal that I've just completed. Um, it's the first one I've made uh, with a spine and I've got three signatures. It's made with a cereal box and the cover is made from papers from the um, DCWV Primrose stack. I really love these papers. And there's a few bits of ephemera um, inside that are also from that. But the majority of this is made with papers from Tsunami Rose um, Charming Fragments uh, digital papers. And I think I used every single one of her um, design pages as well as most of the uh, cut aparts that are available um, with this package. And I just love all the vintage images in them. And although it's highly unlikely I will be writing on these beautiful pages, um, I did make sure I had plenty of blank pages to do actual journaling because that's very important to me. So I'll just go ahead and flip through what I've got and um, show you and then tomorrow I'm going to start using this. I did a little bit of stamping and I have some um, sort of beige um, or yellowish colored paper. This is um, stationery that an artist friend of mine made and I add that to the tuck spot so I still have space for writing. I use some, um, oh, I'm not sure what you'd call this paper, uh, marbled kind of paper in here too and just put little bits of ephemera there. little bit of washi tape, one altered paper clip, I did use a lot of um, coffee stained paper. In the center of each um, signature, I used a an envelope, and I added um, something in each each one. In this case, it's, it's some coffee stained papers that can be written on, and added bits of um, ephemera on the outside and a tag. few pages have some um, uh, lace on them. Tuck spot here. It's the end of one signature and the beginning of the next.
These are from Graphic 45. As I mentioned in a previous video, I like using these um, envelopes and the little inserts that fit in them, but I also want to maximize my writing space, so I used washi tape in such a way that it would flip out and give me more writing space on the page itself. Just little bits of ephemera that I could write on the, out, um, on the other side of these. it. It's um, closed with uh, ribbon, just ribbon and some, um, well, I forget what you call those little things. Anyway, <laughs> and I may add something to the front here. I really like the look of this, um, but I haven't decided for sure yet, so I may um, add something later. I like a flat Cover because ultimately it'll end up on my bookshelf and I don't want to smash any um, decorative items that would be on the front. So, um, And when I stitched it together using Baker's Twine, it seems to be working well. So thank you very much for watching.